Pop it like it's hot. Pop it like it's hot. Hey, we're getting it popping here, y'all. And so excited for you to join our dancer arm workout. For today's workout, we're going to be using wrist weights. If you'd like a level up, we've each got one pound wrist weights on. And then we're going to be using a set of three pound weights. So that's just going to keep it light. We're doing high reps. It's going to be extra spicy to the rhythm and to the beat. Now I am in my second trimester. So this is a pregnancy safe workout and Brooke is obviously just going full out. So you have both of us to watch as we power through working that upper body. I want you to keep your arms lifted the whole time. That's going to be the challenge to not let our arms drop, right? For me too. <laughs> I'm like, come on arms. And we're going to have a lot of fun. So let's do it. Let's take those feet wide apart, soft bend to your knees. We're gonna roll those shoulders up and back so we place them right into our spot. Nice lifted posture here. And then you're gonna bring your arms front into this first position. It's gonna go open, close, up, down. We're moving slow and controlled, focusing on our posture this entire workout and connecting to our core. Take it open, close, up, down. Really focusing on the placement with the arms here. Moving with intention and with grace. Double open right here. So it goes double open, close, lift. On that double open, you want to feel the back, the shoulder blades drawing in and together. Next stays long. Good, give me one more. Hold it center right here. We take it crisscross, one and then the other. Now you can start to add just a little bitty lean side to side so you're getting into those obliques. Feeling that work through the chest, through the shoulders. Keep going, eight, six, four, three. Hold it right here, press the arms out and in. So just those palms give me that rotation. We're gonna take the feet right underneath our hips. Keep that soft bend to the knees. Rotate, rotate. Now hold it right here. We're gonna take it high fifth. We're gonna press back hinge. High fifth, press back hinge. I want you to tap into your inner ballerina. Brooke was a soccer player, so she's smiling, but she gets it. Look at her go, so graceful. We're working those hinges from the hips. We're staying connected through our core back and glutes. Hold this next one back, just pulse the arms. Now you wanna make sure that you're lengthening your spine so you're not rounding that upper back. Trying to keep your hands above your booty if you can so we stay in those triceps. Good, now squeeze this in right here. In, in. Little bitty squeezes. Can you get your arms a little bit more straighter? And then open out the chest and your heart while drawing your belly button to spine. Good, right here we're gonna take it for a kick back. So just a tiny bend and press. Are we feeling that fire in the back of the arms? Yes, totally triceps right here. Keep it pressing. Exhale, breathe. You've got it. Now hold it back, rotate the palms. They're gonna go in and up, in and up, in and up. They rotate in and up. So it gets a little bit more spicy in those shoulders. Squeeze. You're here for four, for three, for two. Hold the palms facing in, black swan. Back of the wrist tap, lower it back down. We're gonna take a nice butterfly range of motion. So big swan arms all the way around, nice and graceful, up and lift, and down. Four more, let's go, four. Beautiful, for three, yes. For two, one more. 
Now right here, you're gonna reach it to the front, serve it up, reach to the front, brush stroke around to the back. Reach to the front, brush stroke around to the back. Again, working those hinges right at the hips. So we're really focusing on that connection through the core and into the back. Reach and around. Good job, reach and around. Two more, reach and around. One more, reach. Hold it back right here, little bitty pulse. Can you get those arms a little bit higher? Yes, that's it. It's a competition now. Get them a little bit higher. Yes, squeeze, let's go. Eight, we're here for six. You've got it, four, three, two, one. Lower it down, roll those shoulders out. Amazing. Grab your three pound weights. We're adding to it right here. Soft bend to your knees. I want you to have your elbows in by your side. Open out on the diagonals. Little bitty pulses up and lift. So while we're here, just be mindful of your wrist. Make sure that they're not dropping down or curling up so you don't have any pressure there on the wrist, okay? Full range of motion, let's go. Up and down. Exhale, exhale. Still staying focused on that posture, growing tall out through the crown of the head. Belly button draws in towards the spine. Back to those pulses right here, go. Up and lift. Feeling that spice in the biceps. Exhale, breathe. You've got it here for four, for three, for two. Take it back, full range of motion right here. Let's go up and down. Exhale and inhale. Every time you exhale, flex your core a little bit more. Squeeze. That's it, reach. Now, hold it to that halfway. We're gonna reach the right arm, front diagonal, then switch. Think about serving it up. Exhale, breathe as you reach. Exhale, flex your abs. Exhale, squeeze. Yes. Both together, let's go. Reach, reach. Stay connected through that core. Squeeze, squeeze. Now we're gonna take it, reach, then tap the weights forward. In, reach, tap, open. In, reach, tap, open. In, reach, tap, yes. In, reach, hold it here, just tap it for eight. For six, we're gonna press back. Hinge, reach front, let's go. Press back, reach front. We've already warmed this move up. That's it, good job. Reach it back, press it front, reach it back. Arms are feeling worked now. Back and front. Hold it back right here, straight arms, little bitty pulse. Let's lift, same thing here. Make sure that spine stays lengthening, y'all. No bending at the wrist. No rounding in that upper back. We're here for four. We're here for three. Yes, for two. Turn the palms in, let's kick it back. It goes in, kick it back. In, kick it back. In, reach it back. Yes, four more. Four, three, two. Hold it back right here, turn the palms up. Pulse, up and lift. Teeny tiny pulse, up. And lift, turn the palms in, kick it back right here, let's go. In, kick it back. In, kick it back. In, kick it back. Bring it up to standing, shoulder press, reach up. Reach up. Exhale, lift. We're here for four. We're here for three. Take the feet a little bit wider. Alternate right and left, slow right. In, left, in. Right, and left, four more, four. Keep that connection to core, yes, two. Same thing to the front, right and left. Go, reach, in, reach, in, reach, reach. Let's go for four, three, two. Now, both elbows in, serve it up. Reach, in, exhale. 
inhale, exhale, inhale. Yes, keep serving it up for four. You've got it, three. Yes, for two. Hold it to the front right here. Little bitty right, left, right, left, right, left. Stay with me. Don't drop those arms. Tap it right here, final eight. You've got it, six. Come on for four, three, two, one. Lower it down. You did it. Roll those shoulders out. Woo, carefully set those weights down. High five up top. My arms feel like wet noodles. <laughs> Mission accomplished. Flex on them, y'all. Yes, we love it. If you enjoyed that workout, be sure to subscribe to our channel for new workouts that we drop every single week and join our Sweat Sisterhood community here at Hood Fit. We're all about empowering you to be your best self and rep your womanhood. So join our fabulous community and we'll see y'all in the next workout. Bye, y'all. Oh, 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 o